Ever feel like building muscle after 40 seems harder than it used to be? Maybe you're wondering, is it even possible to see real gains at my age? Well, I've got good news, it absolutely is. But you'll need to train smarter, not just harder. As we age, our bodies change. But that doesn't mean you can't build muscle. In fact, with the right exercises and a little know-how, you can keep getting stronger and feeling better than ever. Today, I'm sharing five key exercises that are perfect for building muscle after 40. These exercises focus on strength, stability, and function, so you can move well and live better, no matter your age. All right, let's jump into the first exercise, the deadlift. The deadlift is often called the king of strength exercises, and for good reason. It's a compound movement that engages multiple muscle groups, making it incredibly effective for building overall strength. When you perform a deadlift, you're working your entire posterior chain, which includes the muscles in your back, glutes, hamstrings, and calves. This is particularly important as we age because these muscles play a key role in maintaining good posture, balance, and stability. Strengthening your posterior chain helps protect against common issues like lower back pain and poor mobility, both of which can become more prevalent after 40. One of the biggest advantages of the deadlift is its functional application to daily life. Think about how often you bend down to pick something up, whether it's groceries, a child, or even a bag of laundry. A proper deadlift mimics this movement, training your body to lift objects safely and efficiently, which can help prevent injuries, especially as you get older. By practicing this movement with a focus on good form, you'll not only build muscle, but also improve your movement patterns, making everyday tasks easier. Form is crucial when it comes to deadlifting, especially as you age. The key is to keep your back straight and your core braced to avoid putting too much strain on your lower back. As you lift the weight, drive through your heels, engage your glutes, and focus on using your legs and hips rather than your back to lift. By maintaining proper technique, you can safely build muscle while minimizing the risk of injury. Start with lighter weights and gradually increase the load as your strength improves, ensuring that you're challenging your muscles without overloading them. The deadlift is also highly adaptable to suit your fitness level. Whether you're a beginner or more advanced, you can modify the deadlift by using kettlebells, dumbbells, or a barbell, depending on your comfort and ability. For those with mobility limitations or lower back concerns, starting with a trap bar or even performing Romanian deadlifts, which place more emphasis on your hamstrings, can be excellent alternatives. This versatility makes the deadlift a must-have in any strength training routine particularly for those looking to build muscle after 40. Next up is the goblet squat. Goblet squats are an excellent lower body exercise, especially suited for those over 40 looking to build strength without overloading their joints or compromising their back. This exercise involves holding a dumbbell or kettlebell at chest height, which helps engage your core as you perform the squat. Unlike traditional back squats, the goblet squat places the weight in front of your body, encouraging better posture and balance throughout the movement. This makes it an ideal choice for anyone who struggles with mobility or flexibility, as it helps you maintain a more upright torso during the squat. What makes goblet squats particularly effective is their ability to target multiple muscle groups at once, including your quadriceps, glutes, hamstrings, and core. This exercise improves functional strength, which means it enhances your ability to perform everyday tasks, like bending down to pick something up or standing from a seated position. It also helps keep your knees and hips healthy by promoting joint mobility and stability, which are critical as we age. Additionally, by focusing on controlled movement and proper technique, goblet squats reduce the risk of injury, making them a safe and efficient way to build lower body strength and endurance. Incorporating goblet squats into your routine a couple of times a week can lead to noticeable improvements in strength, balance, and posture. The exercise's versatility also allows for easy modifications. Let's not forget about upper body strength. Pull-ups or assisted pull-ups is a fundamental movement for building upper body strength, specifically targeting the muscles in your back, shoulders, and arms. The primary focus of pull-ups is on your latissimus dorsi, lats, the large muscles that give your back that desirable V-shape. They also engage your biceps, forearms, and even your core, making it a highly effective compound movement. For those over 40, it's important to emphasize functional strength and pull-ups are perfect for improving your ability to lift and pull things in daily life. However, full pull-ups can be quite challenging, especially if you haven't been training for a while or are just getting started. That's where assisted pull-ups come in. You can use a resistance band looped around the bar and under your feet or knees to give you a boost. Alternatively, many gyms have pull-up machines that provide assistance by offsetting some of your body weight. This modification allows you to build strength gradually without overstraining your muscles or joints. One of the best things about incorporating pull-ups into your routine after 40 is the focus on grip strength. 
Grip strength tends to decline with age, but exercises like pull-ups can help combat this. A strong grip is crucial for overall upper body functionality, improving your ability to carry, lift, and hold onto objects with ease. Consistently working on pull-ups, whether full or assisted, will lead to noticeable improvements in your upper body strength, posture, and overall mobility. Push-ups are another essential exercise, but don't underestimate their power. This exercise primarily targets the chest, shoulders, and triceps, making it a fantastic choice for upper body strength. Beyond that, push-ups also engage the core and stabilize the muscles of the back, promoting overall functional fitness. One of the great things about push-ups is their versatility. They can be modified to suit different fitness levels, making them accessible whether you're a beginner or more advanced. If a standard push-up is too challenging initially, you can start with inclined push-ups, using a sturdy surface like a bench or countertop. This adjustment reduces the weight your arms need to lift, allowing you to build strength gradually. Conversely, if you find traditional push-ups easy, you can elevate the challenge by trying variations like diamond push-ups, which emphasize the triceps, or decline push-ups, which shift more focus to the upper chest. Maintaining proper form is crucial for maximizing the effectiveness of push-ups and minimizing the risk of injury. Start in a plank position with your hands placed slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Your body should form a straight line from your head to your heels, engaging your core and glutes to avoid sagging or arching your back. As you lower yourself, keep your elbows at about a 45 degree angle to your body and lower your chest towards the floor. Pushing back up, focus on engaging your chest and shoulders to return to the starting position. Incorporating push-ups into your workout routine is an effective way to enhance upper body strength and stability. You can perform them anywhere, making them a convenient option for home workouts or when traveling. Last but not least, the Farmer's Carry. The Farmer's Carry is a straightforward yet highly effective exercise that packs a punch in terms of building functional strength. To perform it, you simply pick up a pair of heavy dumbbells or kettlebells and walk for a set distance or duration. The beauty of this exercise lies in its simplicity. You don't need any special equipment and it can be done anywhere, inside a gym, in a park or even at home. This makes it an incredibly versatile addition to your workout routine. When you engage in a farmer's carry, you activate multiple muscle groups throughout your body. Your grip strength is challenged as you hold the weights, which is crucial for everyday tasks like carrying groceries or lifting objects. Additionally, your shoulders, core, and legs all work in harmony to stabilize your body as you walk. This creates a full body workout that helps improve your posture and balance, which can decline with age. Another remarkable aspect of the farmer's carry is its emphasis on functional movement patterns. Unlike many traditional exercises that isolate specific muscles, this carry mimics real-life activities. This functional aspect is vital for maintaining independence and mobility as you age. Whether you're moving furniture, taking a walk with a heavy backpack, or simply navigating your day, the strength gained from this exercise translates directly into improved performance in daily activities. To get started, choose weights that challenge you without compromising your form. It's essential to maintain a straight posture while walking, keeping your shoulders back and core engaged, Start with shorter distances, focusing on walking steadily and maintaining control. Incorporating these exercises into your routine, you'll see some serious gains, both in strength and overall quality of life. Your age is just a number. What matters most is how you take care of your body today. With that said, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching and see you next time.